Okay, so hello everyone. Today I just have a simple tutorial telling you how to do Nova XT Turbo and the like. So if you open up your Nova Patcher here, it should be fairly easy to find. And go down to the bottom right to Nova XT settings, this small button here. You will get the screen that says this this isn't turbo. What you want to do is you want to go down here to turbo. Well, it actually says it, and this is basically your turbo setup. So how this works is say, let's say I want to put my F2 key onto turbo, but all you need to do is you need to drag the slider, and you have two settings or three, I guess. Disabled turbo and smartcast. Disabled means you have no turbo, or you need to press the button manually. That's that. Turbo means it will automatically continuously use the key, but you won't click your mouse cursor. So for skills like reverberation or sharpshooting, you won't be using this. Smartcast, it continuously holds down the button and continuously clicks your mouse. So this is for reverberation, sharpshooting, like 90% of the skills in the game where you need to target something. It will hold down the skill button and keep pressing. And it's as simple as that, really, you can do it on any key on your keyboard. Uh, F1 to F9 is usually what keys are used. But while I'm here, I'll also go over the other stuff, basically. So status time is it lets you see if, oh, I want to see if I'm provoked, I want to see if I am have a box of sunlight, so it's sunlight. I want to see this stuff, uh, no minutes, seconds indicator. A minute seconds is okay, so this will basically show me if I have a box of sunlight active. Please do show me that, I would love to know. You could also do this for like braggy, so poem of braggy, mini mini effects is for like uh, slash m2e from what I remember. Skill circle range, skill circle range 2, and skill circle range 3, and skill circle range 4, all these skill circle ranges. You know what I'm talking about, the slash, that one. Rob detection range is, you know, that one, slash box, slash dead cells. Uh, turbo setup, so this is like, you have two settings here, you have the new algorithm, the old algorithm, I generally keep on the new algorithm. Since it's made for the new client that I'm using old algorithms for the old client. Model calling, you can, this lets you make, like, make models invisible, like the rocks, the trees, anything you want. I'm completely fine with my models being enabled. Also cool, reduces the amount of frames the game renders when you're not using it. Basically, saves on your GPU's GPU-ness when you're not playing the game. Z-Bias, probably don't touch that unless you know what you're doing. Show pings, show FPS, unlock FPS, pretty self-explanatory really, not much more to talk about. Um, so yeah, some people requested this, so that's all I have to say really. Thank you for watching everyone, have a nice day and uh, peace, bye.